Hello and welcome to another Stack Team App Help video. This video is about access groups. Access groups are a very important part of your app as they allow you to segment members into groups to streamline communication, many you can post news, create events and open chat rooms for specific groups of members. Once you've watched that video, it'd be great to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our YouTube channel and also make sure you hit the bell icon so you turn on alerts, so you get notified when we upload future videos. Access groups can be created by the app or the website dashboard, but it's easiest to manage them via your team's dashboard by logging in at stackteamapp.com. Click on the Access Groups button, where you can see this app has already a number of access groups created. To create a new group, click the blue New button to the top right corner of the page. You can have as many access groups as you wish and can edit or delete them at any time. Name your group and choose whether you want this to have access to the Teams or Availabilities feature in your app. An auto-approve access group means members won't have to require administrator approval to join that group, meaning anyone can join and see your content straight away. Admin use only will allow you to hide a group so members won't see it listed when joining your app. An example might be an executive board group or a group of elected officials. These membership fields are what members will require to answer when requesting access to that group. You can also create custom fields for information you need to capture from your members. We'll also show you how to create fields later in this video. Once you've selected your required fields, hit the blue create button and that group is now live. If you have a number of access groups you want to add at the one time, we also have an import feature. Click the three dots on the access groups page and select import. Then download our template to your computer and fill in the information. Place the access group name in column A and the term true for any other appropriate column. Save the CSV file and navigate back to your import page. Select the file, click the checkbox to add all rows and select the save button. Now to create custom questions. Navigate back to the dashboard and select admin settings. Scroll to the bottom of the page where you'll find custom membership fields. You will notice any other membership fields that have already been created or if you'd like to create a new one, then select add membership question. Here we will ask for their favorite color. Leaving the answer field blank will allow freeform answers or separated with a comma provides members a drop-down list to choose from when answering the question. When you're finished, select update and this question will now be available for your access groups. When creating, for example, a news article, the admin can then choose which access groups receive that content and then can send a push notification and or an email to the members of those specific access groups and those members can see the information. Thanks for watching another Stack Team App Help video. As always, please feel free to reach out at support.teamapp.com if you need further advice on access groups or any other Stack Team App feature.